U.S. Uh, spends not only vastly more than China does militarily, but more than the next 20 countries in the world militarily. The United States is the world's leading power. China is narrowing the gap consistently. What we've done is we've trained two generations, 40, 50 years of economists, yeah. with theories that patently don't work. And then we're surprised that the models they build blow up on us. There is a transnational elite that is not held accountable for the ways in which they have carried on financial dealings. The love, I want to feel the love. I'd like to um, put 700 million euro on, on that horse there, Anglo lad. Bring the economists to Kilkenny, bring the stand-ups to Kilkenny and ask the stand-ups to go for the gags when they're there, but their job is really clarity, facilitating, communicating. The, the 750 million uh, loan that you just Anglo-Irish just paid over, notice the words unsecured. That means if it's unsecured and we can't pay it, fuck you. Corrupt government with a saving rate of 40% sounds a lot better than a corrupt government with a saving rate of zero, which is the US. <laughs> Rescue packages are nothing more than transferring the debts of private professional investors on to innocent taxpayers. One of my children, I have seven children, and one of them I had to force austerity on. <laughs> and, and she was not happy about that and stamped her foot and... and, and, and uh, she didn't call it a referendum or anything, did she? <laughs> she did, and I voted, and she, got, she lost. <laughs> Recapitalization, over to you, Peter. It's what Cork people are banging on about for you. <laughs> <laughs> Look at the red hot favorite there, Anglo lad with its golden shoes, that's straight out there. 120% definitely gonna win that horse. Who, who would bet against it? <laughs> Fraud is so much a part of the American economy right now. You have to take economics out of the conference room and out of academia and make it accessible to ordinary people's lives. We're going to try and get really in and find out, like, what's going on. I think that what will happen to Greece is that they won't pay. You still have idiots running, you know, one of the major world powers who think that banning X Factor is, is in the 21st century, a way of asserting social control. You know, so, so they have very little understanding, very often, of the way in which large parts of the modern world are working. Anglo Lad is down there. He's down. He's oh. not fucking out. Desperate, desperate poverty still. I mean, there's still 700 million Chinese living in most desperate poverty. He's, he's trying to get up. No, he's been shot in the head. No, but he's still trying to get up. The horse lost, and I only spent 350 million euro on this. Doesn't matter that it's a pot of glue there on the racetrack. We're going to give you 700 million because that's the kind of people we are. Complete fucking idiots. That's what we are. This is important, ladies and gentlemen.